Dean Bosler here. I'm in Full Shear, Texas. It's um, west and just a little south of Houston, south of Katy. This is October 13th, 2010, and the webworms is what we're looking like, or what we are looking at here on the pecans. Uh, we can't use organic conserve on webworms because it's not labeled for fruit and nut trees, so we use something different. BT is super popular too, but we hate it. I hate it. It's very harmful to beneficial. So these are some monster trees. I'm not that good at estimating height, but um, what happened with this homeowner is that he paid a guy to spray for webworms. And when he still had webworms, he says, oh, oh, I'm sorry, no, we don't, we don't spray the tree tops. We can't get to the top. And so my question is, well, why, oh yeah, we're, we're in excess of 80 feet here. These trees are super tall. So, there's the river, Fulcher Creek, I guess. And these pecans, that one easily exceeds 80 feet. A uh, note here in the foreground, the American elm is really off color. They have, um, you get really bad mite and lace bug damage. And I will show you across the creek another American elm. Look at that one. That thing is yellow. It is yellow because it's got, you know, my pocket diagnosis is severe lace bug and mite damage. So these pecans, I don't think you can treat them for enough stuff. They get mites real bad. I think I recall they get aphids. I think I remember seeing aphids on them. The hackberry, the box elder, the green ash. They're fine, but uh, don't don't sell. It's the same with um, it's the same with pine bark beetles. Don't sell it a service you can't provide. This guy was doing pine bark beetle treatments. Who knows what he was using? Twenty bucks a tree, and he was spraying twenty feet in height. Well, that's all I can reach. Well, okay, then don't provide the service. Okay? So I'm taking you back to the street, showing you the one the one sticking up the highest. It's a, it's a very tall tree. So anyway, make sure you've got the ability to reach the tops before you go taking people's money for this.